I am Ron, I am the camp director, and uh, I, this, uh, the camp director of Camp Uwala, to be precise, yes. How do you feel about Camp Awika? It's uh, Camp Uwala. Sorry, how do you feel about it being number one in the country? I think this will bring in more hampers. Um, excuse me, what are hampers besides the laundry basket? Uh, it's what I call campers. Happy little campers. Understand? Hi, I'm Katie and I'm the assistant director. What do you do for the camp? I do basically everything that Ron doesn't do, which is everything. How do you feel about the camp being number one in the country? I think that we totally deserve it. I feel like the entire staff has worked their very hardest to get where we are. So if the campers are in the water and I need to go to the bathroom, do I go or not? No. Yeah. Well, eh. So let me get this straight. I have to stay up till 11 o'clock p.m., which, by the way, is prime lake surfing time. And I have to do that for the campers? Yeah, I mean, it's your job. So, um, I hear that the campers have limited ice cream days. Does that apply to us? Honestly, as counselors, we can do whatever we want. Yay! Yeah, I think you guys are ready. No, I, no, no, no. I'm Caroline, I'm a counselor, and I am a professional surfer. How do you feel about the camp being number one in the country? I'm psyched, bro. This is a cool camp. What do you do for the camp? Well, I mean, I do music and stuff, but only because Ron forced me to. But, um, I mean, I'd rather be riding the waves, bro. Gardening is so fun. <laughs> is this where we're gardening this year? Yeah, we couldn't afford outside gardening, but inside is still fun. Okay. Um, so while you weed the garden, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Okay, see you later! Guys, come on. Just come. Uh, this is a little, little weird. No, I just, like, it's the only place I get privacy. Are you sure you want to be talking in the bathroom? Yeah, it's the only place I have privacy. So, Last year, I was um, with Ron. Wait, wait, I got a text message. Uh, Aaron, you okay? Hello? Guys! Tables have a guys. Guys. Two towers. guys! We have a problem. Aaron is not responding. It's okay that you guys aren't friends. No, I mean like she was talking and then she stopped talking and is no longer responding. Yeah, like... I think she's dead. I'm sure she's fine. You're going to edit this out, right? How did it happen? We don't know, but we believe she was killed. Oh my goodness, do you know who did it? No, do you have any suspicion? Well, I mean, it was probably Carter. He doesn't care about her or this camp. I don't really know what's up with him. I've just never trusted that hermit. Oh, well, that's interesting. One second.
because this trophy of ours, this number one camp in the universe trophy, is what really matters the most. And if we don't tell anyone, the murder is just going to continue, continue, and continue. They chose to... S my Can you please stop that? Sorry. My employees are the ones who chose to sacrifice for this camp. They never specified how much they would sacrifice. Therefore, that, that could imply that they were willing... Shut up! Sorry. They were willing to sacrifice their lives. That It could imply that. Okay, well then, what are we supposed to do? I'd say the logical thing to do would be to investigate. Hmm. We gotta know who did this. I, hey, don't throw that. Yeah. Where's where's the trash can? <laughs> People are dying uh, and you're laughing. I'm sorry. I, I laugh know, under pressure. It great. <laughs> We're not investigating. We're not doing anything. It's hard to keep a straight face all the time. That meeting was intense. Intense. No one could keep a straight face and people are actually dying out there and they don't care so what are you gonna do about it i don't know i'm definitely not investigating though if you're not gonna investigate then what's next i'm just gonna call the cops i don't care anymore Is she okay? I don't know. She looked at her phone for a bit and then got a text message and fell. Mm, all right then. So, uh, do you know if she's dead? No, I'm not a doctor. I'm an interview person. All right then. All right then. I guess we'll go find someone to cover her schedule. Oh, oh okay. Oh, shoot. You know, Katie and Ron have been acting really weird lately, and I think that they could possibly be behind these deaths. I definitely agree. I think ever since ever since that video team has come, they've been killing off staff. I think that Ron may be the killer. I agree. I don't know uh, what to do. Yeah, uh, so I guys might need one of you guys to cover for Katie. Why? What happened? Um, nothing. She just, uh... She just uh, she died. broke her arm. Ron, what happened? Fine, fine, she died. Caroline. I'm sorry, it's actually Coraline. I've changed my name. Go on. Okay. Um, how do you feel about Katie's death? It has to be Ron. I can't, like, nothing else makes sense. Ron is definitely behind this, and I'm going to try to catch him in... I got a text. I'll open it later. Are you sure you don't want to look at it? No, whatever. I don't really look at my text messages. No. Oh, the lake is calling. I gotta go. Yeah, oh, okay, bye. How do you feel about the deaths of all your counselors? I feel it will bring some bad reputation. Not, not horribly bad, but bad reputation. Are you worried about Camp Uga Chaka losing its number one title? Uh, no. Oh, yeah, it's Uwala. Uwala. Oh, named oh. after my grandmother. Oh, whoops. Oh, yeah, the question. Uh, I am not worried about the camp losing its number one title to that other camp, MAC. Yeah, MAC. Yeah. To them... Uh, they're literally just an ant crushed under our 
our shoe. It, oh, it makes me so giddy thinking about it. In interesting. I know. Hey, bro, meet me at the lake at 2 o'clock for some epic lake surfing. Yeah, wait one second. Someone's spamming me. This is the curse of Ooga Chaka. This is the curse Go on, of Ooga on. Chaka. Um, I need you to cover for this is a... the curse of Ooga It's a Lola! It was named after my this grandmother! Is the curse of Ooga Chaka. <laughs> I need you this to is take the any shit. Ooga Chaka. This is the curse of Ooga Chaka. How do you feel about the death of another counselor? Yeah. Um, I don't feel too badly um, because I'm pretty sure they got twins and no one would notice. Well, do you still feel like it won't threaten Uga Chaka's reputation? It's a Lola! It was named after my grandmother! <laughs> She's dead. Oh. Um. Wait a minute. You're the killer! Why did you do it? Because I work for MAC and they're not an ant to be stepped on. Oh, really? This is the curse <laughs> of Uga Chaka. This is the curse 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 of Uga Chaka.